So I began cooking methamphetamines, massive amounts, five or 600 grams at a time. And we'd do it three or four times a week. And the cops were after me. They were always trying to catch me. And I was pulling into a house in Benton, Arkansas. And you have to understand that because of my lifestyle, there was people that was always trying to rob me because they wanted the dope or the money or kill me because they was mad at me because I wouldn't sell them no dope or turn me into the police because they was mad because I wouldn't sell them dope. And as I pulled into that house, a man jerked open the car door. He threw, put a pistol like this in the car. When he did, I just grabbed his arm and pulled him into the car with me. And like them cartoons, one fist going out one window, leg going out this one. We were fighting in that car, and I was thought I thought I was fighting for my life. And I got the gun away from him, and I threw it out on the ground. And when I did, a badge popped out of his shirt on a chain. Now, I don't know how they are up here in Canada, but in Arkansas, the popo don't like it when they take your gun, when you take their gun from them, all right? I was going to tell you. Anybody in here ever been pepper sprayed? You ain't never going to hear me say pass the pepper. I'm just going to tell you right now. I've been pepper sprayed so many times, I should be orange, okay? Well, they drug me out of the car, pepper sprayed me. I'm telling you, they beat the fire out of me. And here's something else I don't understand. After they got through being all mean and mistreating me, they handcuff me and they go to put me in the car and they go, watch your head. Fear me. When I walked in, he said, I need to talk to you about something. I thought, oh God. He said, this is unprecedented. This has never happened in Saline County's history in court. He said, but you think you could get somebody to bring a piano in and you open it up with amazing grace? I said, man, I would love to. They said, all rise. He walked in and he looked at me and pointed. I walked up and I lifted my hands and I began to sing. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound. And I'm telling you, hands begin to go up in that courtroom. My dad and Brother Lumpkin had their hands raised and I looked back, my little mom had her tears running and I could hear her back there going, and I thought, oh God, here it goes. I'm going to have to explain tongues and interpretation to Judge Gary Arnold because this is about to freak this dude out. And I got done and I sang that old Gaither song, I'm, I'm, I'm free, praise the Lord, free. Judge Gary Arnold walked down off that podium. He had a stack of charges this thick. Pastor, he walked up to me. He said, Nick Mahaney, here's your charges. You can shred them. You can shred them. You can frame them. You can burn them. He looked at me and said, because you're a free man. I find no fault in you. 